Good evening. It was a terrifying scene at a Miami area nightclub. An altercation led to gunfire, which then turned into a full on shootout with police. Innocent bystanders caught in the crossfire. When the bullets stopped, two people were dead, seven were injured. Victims treated on the sidewalk outside the club. Others rushed to the hospital, including one police officer. There are now two investigations a homicide investigation into the shooting that started it all and an investigation into the officer-involved shooting. Marisa Parra starts us off from Doral, just outside Miami. I want to warn you, some of the images in this story are disturbing. Deadly chaos at 3.30 in the morning inside a Miami-area nightclub, spilling onto the streets. Shots fired at City Place Doral. Nine people shot inside, two of them killed, including the bar's security guard. You start hitting shots. And it wasn't one, it was one after another, after another, after another. Peter Jordan was among those enjoying Doral's Martini Bar, known for its nightlife and one of the few places in the area open till 4 a.m. But this, just 30 minutes before closing. Four to five people shot plus an officer. Police say it started with an altercation. The security guard that was working intervened, and that's when the subject produced a firearm and shot and killed the security guard. Authorities say two Doral police officers then jumped in, exchanging gunfire with the shooter, killing him. One of those officers also catching a bullet in his lower extremity. One of the officers, the one who was struck with four years of service, um, applied a tourniquet on himself immediately after being struck. Six bystanders, five men and a woman, according to police, were shot in the crossfire. You start thinking right after, right? When you're in the floor, you start thinking, is this going to be at the end? This is, I'm not going to die here. Victims appearing to be treated outside, captured on this graphic video. The injured rushed to area hospitals, one of them in critical condition. You think that it's never going to happen to you in a night where you're having fun, right? You're two feet away. I could be there right now. Marisa Parra joins me now from near the scene of the shooting of the six bystanders shot. Marisa, do we know if any were hit by a gunfire from the police? Jose, it's an important question that many people are asking, and police are saying they don't yet have the answer. And to find out will require a forensic investigation, which authorities say will take time. Jose? Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.